to stay, with you to stay. You can't move my army, no, no, no way. Hey, hey. No way, no way. The figures okay yeah well you know how we do it around here <laughs> my bad you saw the kitty cat though right what's up everybody a solid start yes Dan K knows what's up we do that from time to time around here sorry everybody all right let's go like I was saying it is drop day once again good morning everybody happy Sunday microphone check one two one two and all the homies are in the house for this one although it seems like a lot of people might be skipping this drop. What's up, Sean Grasmic? Grasmic's having a rough week, but it is his favorite type of drop. It's a Lambo drop. We got Tucson in the house. Hopefully, Tucson will be on his best behavior. He's been talking a lot of trash to people in the Discord, from what I can see. We got Kurazimi here. My man Thanu's in the house. Booty Jizz says it's a pass, and he's probably right. What's up, Ryan Corral? Here you go, kitty cat. Just don't chew on my cords. Yeah, sorry about the the volume on the start. I didn't know. I didn't check. My bad. My bad. All right, so are we going for this one? We're going to check out some of the prices of the other Lamborghini drops. I think everything goes under retail except for the Secret Rare, so that makes it a pass for me, especially at 70 Jimmies. We got Big A in the house. What's up, Big A? Not buying, just here to be with your live stream. Thank you, my man. Appreciate that, bro. Let's go, everybody. We got Dan K says 25,000 MCP for real. Wait, what? I don't even think it's selling out, personally. I'm with Gus Hall here. Tucson says it is selling out, though, so maybe we're wrong. Maybe Tucson's right. Jared Souza's in the house, not going for it, says price predictions literally just take a look at the Diablo drop. That's what we're going to do, check out some of those other drops. Uh, hopefully the Pokemon are popping up today. Slack Rex in the house, says too much money, yes, 70 jimmies. We got IMT, we got Ledges in the house. Good morning, Ledges. Anyone taking bets as to whether El Jefe gets convicted or not? That's a good question. I mean, he's clearly guilty. He's talking about uh, Trump. Get drunk, everybody. Let's go. He's clearly guilty because his lawyer already went to jail for the exact same crime. However, they're not going to put a, an, an ex-president in prison. They're just not going to do that. So I don't know how it's going to work. We got Simply Marvelous in the house. Says, I missed the trooper's footwork. Oh, I could bring that back. That was a good one. <laughs> we got Red Hot Snacks in the house. Let's go. Tom Tom's here. Woody's in the house. OG Red Hot. I already said that. True Stoner. Let's go. What's up, everybody? Rewind 2001. Mr. Jake KD says he's skipping. Yes, the OG is here. Let's go. We need some uh, We need some content because I've been looking at um, at YouTube, at VV content, and people are struggling. Uh, I guess my collectibles even, isn't even making videos anymore. Randy Chavez videos never do good. And then even, like, uh, even the regular people that I like to watch, not getting as many views. It feels like the whole vb ecosystem is dying dying slowly denny oc in the house happy sunday good luck my man good luck everybody going for this or maybe that's just me maybe i'm biased on that jay hirsch says philadelphia sports fans are the worst sports fans in the world didn't the 70 who were the 76ers playing the knicks i know all the all the favorites won last night i, I didn't get to see if the lakers won against the nuggets but at the end in the fourth quarter when i stopped watching lakers were down by like 10 so Looks like all the favorites are winning. Pacers play tonight, though. Pacers against the Bucks, And I don't think Giannis is going to play. So hopefully not. <laughs> we got Ice Tank in the house. Says, I'm going to go for one. I mean, that's on you, bro. We got Hammy in the house. We got Gritty One. Let's go. Let's go. 
I don't know if I'm going for one. I mean, I know I'm not going for one. I don't know if you should go for one. I mean, it's going to be a gamble. If you get a secret rare, you're going to do all right. If you get a good serial number, maybe you'll do all right. However, most likely, you're going to get something other than secret rare, and it's going to be below retail. Henry Overseas, first in the chat today, I believe. I can't go back that far to see. Haney got molly whooped last night. Haney molly whopped. I don't know what either one of those things mean. I don't know who Haney is, and I don't know what molly whopped means. It's a good it's a good word though. I wanna I wanna know the definition so I can start using it. Weren't you buying ordinals a while back? Yes, I bought ordinals before most people. And the new thing with the ordinals are the runes. And runes are kinda like careful with my mic here. Runes are kinda like uh, meme coins on Bitcoin. And they just started dropping during the halving, which was two days ago. But they're super, super complicated, man. You gotta buy SATs, you gotta buy uh, nodes. I don't know. I, it was too much for me. I couldn't do it all. What's up, Larry Mackins? Good luck if you decide to go for this one. Oliver wants me to check his price prediction. I will check that out. Henry Overseas says, I enjoy Muzzle Run. Got into that, and it's pretty fun. Yeah, Muzzle Run's fun. It's a dog racing game on the Matic platform. So you're racing NFTs, and my man BE from the Informant YouTube channel is always live streaming events, Muzzle Run events over there. So make sure you guys check him out on his channel. He'll be live streaming the drops. We got three drops this week, comic drops. I wonder what dirt they will dig up on my collectibles. I'm sure the VB footers are dig. You can't find no dirt on him, dude. Does he seem like the person with dirt? He's just, he just seems a little fake to me, but that's my own personal opinion. Haney is the boxer that got defeated last night by Garcia. I did see that Garcia won. And Molly Wop is a way to say someone got their ass beat. I'm about to get Molly Wopped on the market today. What's up, Dill Pickle? Wants to see the price prediction. What's your deal, Pickle? That's I will always say that. <laughs> so Reddit says, are you going for the drop? Definitely not. Definitely not going for this drop. Every Lembo drop I've gone for, I've hit a common. Well, you're in luck today, Led Jess, because there are no commons. We got an uncommon, a rare, an ultra rare, and a secret rare. Uh, let's check our price predictions, then we'll go in and look at the price of some of the other uh, Lamborghinis that are on the market. So VV price predictions and the price predictions channel. We got four price predictions. If you guys want to add your price predictions in the price prediction channel, just come on over to the Discord server. SAT is a Satoshi. The smallest de denomination of Bitcoin is not another coin. Yeah, but it was something about you had to get some SAT, some sats. They call them sats, I guess. You had to get some sats before you could buy the runes. It's complicated. What's up, Daniel D? What's up, Roto? The drop will be under retail for sure, except for Secret Rare. We got Ronnie Lido in the house. May 4th. What happens May 4th? Did I miss that? That's still far away, so I guess they haven't announced it yet. You can always uh, check K KCBM KCBMW on Twitter. Here, I'll show you. KCBMDubs. You go to his Twitter. Follow him on Twitter. There he is. He's even got Dave, David U messaging or replying. Yeah. <clears throat> Let's see the updated one. I thought I had David U blocked. That shouldn't be popping up. All right, here we go. This is the updated calendar. So you can't see the one that was yesterday, which was the bluegrass stamp drop, which I didn't even stream that one because who cares about stamps, honestly. This is today's drop, and then you can see we got three comics dropping this week, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday, and then, of course, I guess Wednesday at 3 a.m. Eastern Standard Time is when the new VB Comics will hit the VB Comics website. All right, price predictions. We'll start off with Bilby up here. He's got, I don't see yours, Oliver. We got Bilby at 25, 30, 50, and 180. Retail is 70, so he's got all three going below retail except for the secret rare. Mo Quilly's at under retail, under retail, under retail, and 540 on the secret rare. There's 610 editions on the secret rare, so maybe. What's up, Astro VV? Best Lambo today. They do say that this is the best Lambo. I remember Silicon Secure, rest in peace, used to talk about uh, how that was the one Lamborghini model that he wanted most was the Aventador. Oliver says, scroll up. Are you the 100 million billion dollars guy? I don't know. I missed it somehow. I see G Metals with Silver Surfer. I didn't even know that was a thing. I see G Metals with the UPS stamp art. All right, we did Mo Quilly. McCann's got 22 on the uncommon, 28 on the rare, 58 on the ultra rare, and 250 on the secret rare. I got 19, 25, 39, and 125. Then Dan K feeling bullish over here, 30 on the uncommon, 38 on the rare, 55 on the ultra rare, 230 on the secret rare. He might be closer to the truth on these because I don't think they're going to sell out or come close to selling out. And if they don't come close to selling out, then those prices will stay a little bit higher on the less rare ones. I didn't see it, bro. I scrolled all the way up. Did you put it in the price predictions channel? Secret rare over a thousand gem. You crazy, bro. Yeah, I just showed my price predictions on these and I'll show you why. Tito 420 in the house. 
on that 420 gate skipping the drop we got christopher stid let's go everybody thanks for hanging out i'll show you the serial numbers to look for if i can find them right about here yeah 1963 of course 41 you got 1916 350 might be good because the first ever lamborghini was the 350 gtv and then you got the highest serial numbers i probably did not pick a good collar combination on those because you can't see them real well but it's 2018 1418 918 and 618 what's up jay you'll see let's go says i've always been scared to mint a lambo you never minted a lambo i used to go for them all the time but nowadays not so much let's check the lambo prices i've been hearing prices been coming down to the market quite a bit i think the um what is it the ultra rare vaders under 300 gems now i'm surprised that one's so low so this is the one that was the most scarce the verde squirrel hi kitty cat so the secret rare is like the most scarce Lambo of all, and it's at 2,800, but there's only 120 of those. And it's kind of surprising to see number 69 close to the floor there. It's usually a good serial number. So that one does pretty well. Um, let's see what the ultra rare is for that one. Yeah, there's two ultra rares. This one's 52. How many are there? 964. This, this one's at 52. 964 editions and this is also ultra rare i think it has the same amount of editions and it's at 43 and then we will check out the diablo the secret rare diablo at 169 so maybe it'd do better than the secret rare diablo let's see how many editions that secret rare diablo had 640 so pretty much the same as today's and i think people will like the aventador more than the diablo but then the ultra rare is at 49 gems so that would be under retail because retail is 70 what are you doing kitty i know you want to jump on the pc and reset my computer like you always do but not today i'm not going to let you uncommon's at 20 and the rare is at 24 which is kind of my price predictions on today's rare and uncommon all right then you got the hurricane 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 yeah that's what it is not a hurricane i'm thinking a hurricane this was the first the first lamborghini maybe that's why it does better also looks pretty cool. Let's see how many editions there are. Secret rare on this one is 500, and it's got about the same amount of editions uh, as today's drop. Of course, the market was a little bit better back when it dropped. The ultra rare Huracan is at 99. <clears throat> the rare is at 45, and the uncommon is at 40 with superstar money Joe on the floor. If the prices for today's drop are the same as Huracan, then it might be worth going for. Then you got the Countach. Kuntash's rares at 27. Here's your secret rare, 1,200. I think this one was super scarce. Yeah, 130 of those. Kind of wish today's secret rare was scarce like that. Ultra rare on the Kuntash is at 40. Was there two? Oh, this is Murcielago. Murcielago ultra rare is at 59. So you can see all the ultra rares are below retail pretty much. Secret rare on the Murcielago was at 185. So maybe secret rare goes to 150 or 200. I don't think it sells out personally. I could be wrong. I saw a couple people, Tucson thinks it's selling out. I personally don't think it's selling out. What's up, JOC? He says, if y'all were driving them around the VVverse, I would hop in. I mean, if we could drive these around the VVverse, things would be a lot better price-wise. What's up, Pixel Pudding? So, Low Mint Nick just gave up in Flooring Troopers now. I saw that. Somebody mentioned that in my Discord. So, how many did he buy? He bought like a 1,000 of them. And now he's just going to sell them one by one? Ha! <laughs> Bro, he's taking an L. Little Mint Milk, Mick takes lots of L's. How's he doing on those Secret Rare Black Panthers that he stacked? Probably not good. I don't know about the whole idea of stacking. Maybe if we had more users and the market was a little better, I would consider stacking. But the problem with stacking, like, especially thousands, hundreds of these things, is whenever it's time to sell, you got to sell them one by one. Whenever you put a big wall in the market, unless you're doing that on purpose to buy more, which I don't think he is, it's going to take a lot longer to sell all those. All right, Wolverine pumped a little bit after the drop. Come back down a little. I think it went, when it's 140. Then it came back down. But it was under 100 for a while there. All right, let's get ready for today's drop. Not that we're going for it. Walt needs a party bus in the VVverse. I do need a party bus. That'd be cool. Hamley says it's being rugged. What, what happened? Is it my stream? I'm not trying to rug you. They should burn the damn unsold right at drop. Ooh, I like that idea, honestly. That would help with prices. We got Diazzo in the house. Let's go. Good luck with getting the secret rare. Everything else is lost. I'm not even going for it. 
We got the biggest controversy in VB for the last month is how to pronounce autumn. I think I got it right now, right? Autumn. Not not Adam, not A Tim, Autumn. We're gonna have to go check out some old Yu-Gi-Oh videos to find out exactly how to say Autumn. Autumn. Skip, but waiting for secret rare odds to go up. Oh yeah, that might be smart. So he's gonna be keeping track of how many secret rares are left while it doesn't sell out, and there might be a point where when the drop starts, you have 8% chance of getting a secret rare. I don't know exactly what the chances are. We can do the math if you want. But then after some get sold, you might that might go up to like a 12% chance. Kurzemi says, it's definitely a small wall, uh, a cell wall, sorry. A few of us are currently competing to snipe flash cell troopers below mixed wall. Bought a few under 16 so far. Bro, that's a dangerous game you're playing. Tim, not Tum. Ah, Tim. Ah, Tim. See, I still didn't get it right. I was sure I had it right this time. Will this Lambo be the last one? No. They need to get some more different vehicle uh, brands. When's the Ferraris hitting? When are we getting the Teslas? Tesla would be nice. Atim, Atim. Am I saying it right now? Atim, Atim. That's tough, bro. Astro Beauty says I really missed the bull market. Ugh, I don't think it's coming back, man. Especially with this war in the Middle East, all my meme coins have been dropping bad, really bad. No, I gave some alpha before. Don't sleep on runes. <sighs> They're being listed on exchanges. Man, I can't buy everything. First it was like getting to NFTs. Then it was getting to the altcoins and then getting to the meme coins. Now getting to the runes. I still got all my meme coins and altcoins and some NFTs. Rhyme, Rare Grime says crypto is dying for real. I wouldn't say it's dying, but it's not. It's on life support. We got Biggest Bro in the house. Let's go. Hit that like button for me one time for the Biggest Bro. Shakespeare says, good morning, everybody. Good morning, Shakespeare. Yeah, a Bugatti. Now we need an Andrew Tate's Bugatti. Just so I can talk like Andrew Tate. Let's get some minivans and RAV4s. I don't know about minivans. Have Rolls Royce dropped with James Bond already? No. We got the Aston Martin. I would love to get a Rolls Royce. That would be dope. I'm thinking 20 to 25 gems in the aftermarket. There are too many Lambos on the app. There are a bit too many Lambos on the app. I mean, they're pretty scarce, though. If you put all the Lambos together... It's really about as much as a Disney Golden Moment, really. I mean, what are the commons, maybe? Like an Elsa. Are we going for the drop or not? I'm personally not going for this drop. We can start off with a poll to see how many people are going for it. Crypto is healthy and accumulating phase. It's starting to go back up right now, thankfully. In and out, bro. Follow the hype. Otherwise, you end up as a community member. It's too much work. Too much work to follow the hype on the runes. I feel like... uh. I'm playing a game where other people have an advantage over me. My FUD gift was a little laggy there. All right, let's get this poll going to see who's going for today's drop. Start a poll. Are you going for today's Lambo drop? What's up, Davy? You? Yes or no are your options. Are you going to buy yourself a blind box and hope to get the secret rare? Otherwise, might be taking an L. Mandalorian being dropped on Cryptoids? Oh, really? I didn't realize that. They still don't have a market over on Cryptoids. I did notice that they were, apparently, putting out a, uh, a new app. A mobile app, finally. But where's the market? We need that market over there. 15 to 20k Lambos is not enough for the world. It, exactly. That's what I'm trying to say. Autumn. Aut not Autumn. 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 Can I just call you Adam? I've been doing it for two years. So much easier. Stan says, should we expect more from our digital vehicles? I thought NFTs were supposed to do more than physicals, but it seems worse. If we ever get the VV-verse, and I don't necessarily know that we're ever going to get the VV-verse, then yes, you should be able to drive them around, and they used to tease that we'd be able to race them. Can't even sell my GT350 secret rare number 46. Been flooring it for a week. Dang, you've been flooring the number 46, and that doesn't even sell? I know the floor on those is like 2.8K. Ooh, I didn't even think about that, Jared Souza. What if they dropped Harley Davidsons? Now that's a big brand. That's something I used to resell all the time on eBay. Any type of Harley da Davidson branded merch, that stuff goes fast. They got a a huge, a huge um, community, I guess, over there. Marketplace coming in June. They said it. Yeah, right. I'll believe it when I see it. If NFTs explode, they will drop one to ten million Lambos. Well, good. Just as long as we have the scarce ones. Cryptoids market is in June. Okay. So everybody's saying June on the market. Okay. 
I guess I need to start buying then. But what if I start buying a bunch of cryptoids and then June comes around and it's like Vivi, nothing happens. Ducati. I'm going to DM the pronunciation video. Yes, please do. I thought about looking it up on, uh, like I said, Yu-Gi-Oh. <laughs> Yu-Gi-Oh will probably tell me how to pronounce it. Drop some John. Wait, now, that would actually be dope too. John Deere tractors. My kid's playing some game in there and going wild. He is, can y'all hear him? What's up, Captain Obvious? Happy Sunday. I'm going to have to talk louder to talk over my kids screaming in the background. Captain Obvious is going to gamble for this today. I don't know, man. I can't do it. 70 gems. It's quite a big gamble. I'll show you the price predictions again in a second. I'll bet you marketplace in June. So, I mean, usually what happens with these, and I've tweeted about it before with these platforms like Cryptoys is... They get the market before they get the cash out. And during that time between market opening and cash out happening, prices pump like crazy. And then whenever cash out happens, the prices drop. So it is a good money making opportunity. Yeah, he's playing some scary game, he said. I looked went in there earlier. <laughs> Kid's no longer a kid. He sounds like a man. We had Thunder over Louisville yesterday, and he wanted me to drop him off so he could go run around with his friends the whole time and then pick him up afterwards. I'm like, bro, you're 13. No, I'm going with you. I will walk in the whole group with your friends. I don't give a crap if I'm the only adult. Too old to be, too young to be walking around like that. Shout out to the kiddos. I only got one, just so you know. <laughs> Real Goku with the hello ladies. All right, somebody asked for price predictions. Let's pull those up again. The wait list is open. Bro, relax. Uh, wait list is open if you want to go for it. bilby has got 25, 30, 50, and 180 on the secret rare. Mo Quilly is... Agreeing with a lot of people here that it's going to be under retail on the uncommon, under retail on the rare, under retail on the ultra rare, and then secret rare at 540. McCann's at 22, 28, 58, and 250. I got 19, 25, 39, and 125 on the secret rare, though. I think that my secret rare prediction is a little too low. I think 180 sounds more right. Maybe even 250. Probably somewhere between there. Dan K's got 30, 38, 55, and 230 GMEs. We got 11 minutes before it starts. Ah, Tim. Ah, Tim with the super chat. Let's go. Thank you, my man. Appreciate you. Good luck sniping. I got serial numbers to look for. Here we go. Cryptoids is awfully quiet on will cash out be immediately available. I don't think it will be available. 1963 is the chaser today. Daniel sees them the same way. They call me the, the chopper dad because I'm a, always circling around. Yeah, I'm a helicopter parent, 100%. I've been calling myself a helicopter parent for a long time. It's getting old, though. I need to, I need to chill with it a little bit. A friend of mine has been listening, listing some collectibles for me to try to regain some of the gems I lost this week. Help a brother out. I got listings at very good prices. Let me know what you got listed. I'm assuming you're not selling any of your Lamborghinis. You got a big collection of Lamborghinis. What's up, Young Park? Uncommon collar looks the best. I never thought about which collar looks the best. Ooh, the nice green one. I'd like to get a number 420 on the Uncommon. That purple is pretty bright and nice looking. We got Deadpool collars on the Ultra Rare. And it seems like all the Secret Rare Lambos now are black. For the last what four Lamborghini drops, at least the last three Lamborghini drops, all the secret rares are black. I used to have the Mercia Lago for a long time. I know the Diablo is gold, but I think there was one after the Mercia Lago that was black too. And then today's secret rare is black. I don't know what's up with that. Secret rare one twenty says the Yizo Ultra Rare thirty five. Oh, you're being super bearish. I got a Pokemon in my way, so I can't see the rest of them. Rare eighteen on common twelve. Where'd they stop at 2018? I know, I was thinking that too at Autumn. I'm just calling them Big A or no, I heard there's already a Big A. I'm just calling them A. But yeah, I was, I was looking at that when I was doing my serial numbers to look for. And this came out in 2019, so it's weird that the highest serial number is 2018 on this one. There's a few Lamborghinis that were only 20 ever made. I'm curious if they drop those someday. That would be nice, especially if they do only 20 editions. But what, were they going to keep 19? I mean, you know, vivi has got to keep their share. The heck is that noise? Sounds like two owls haven't. No. <laughs> my, ki my kid is playing some game that's like a horror game, a scary game on Steam. I don't know. And he's playing with his friends. So they're all yelling. I like purple. Yeah, that's a nice looking purple. Joker purple suit would be dope. It'd be cool if we could like change the paint schemes. Like if we have a purple one, you could add some green de details or something. Some white details. That'd be pretty cool. A racing stripe. Check the Yu-Gi-Oh vid I sent five seconds long. All right. Did you send it on Discord? Yes, you did. I hope we don't have any other crazy stuff we've said in our... 
I don't think we have. I better put it over here just in case in our DM before I open up our DM live to the world. All right, it's loading up here. There we go. We are going to check out how to exactly how to say autumn. So I'm, what I'm going to need to do is put it over here on this one. It's being a little laggy. All right, we're opening it up. We're going to find out exactly, exactly how to say autumn. I don't know, man. This ain't working. I'm trying to load it up. Come on. Autumn. Autumn. All right, here it goes. It's loading very, very slowly. I don't know why. Probably because my kid's playing something over there, taking all my my bandwidth. What's up, Bob Sells in the house? That could be a good craft idea, that craft to get the strip. Oh, that would be cool. Get a racing, racing stripe by crafting. All right, let's see if this is going to work. All right, whatever. I don't think it's anything important there. Is this going to, oh, I got to probably unmute. I always have this muted. Nope, I don't have it unmuted. All right, let's see if this works. Hopefully it doesn't, doesn't lag me out. I mean, I feel like that's what I was saying. Let me get a little louder here. My name is Autumn. Bring it back one more time. Laggiest video I've ever seen. Why am I crying? Autumn. Autumn. You got to say it like that. I can do that. Autumn. Got you. No problem. Autumn. Now to get this back where it belongs, get over here, then go over here, about right there. Chuck's been going back up a little bit for all you Chuck collectors. We got BE in the chat. What's up, BE? Can't wait to see my Yoda getting out of my Lambo. You got to get a green Lambo for Yoda. You got to. Some of this crypto is starting to rebound, but crypto took a big L with all the, all the stuff going on in the world, especially the Middle East. All right, so let's check this out one more time before the drop begins. You've got one minute to join the queue. The wait list will be closing when it hits five minutes. So you got one minute left to join the wait list. I mean, I could join the wait list, but I, just to see if I get selected, which I'm sure I will. And that's gonna make me feel like I need to hit the button and buy it. I don't really don't want to. I'll join it just for the heck of it. I, but I have to, I have to stop myself from buying this. I cannot buy this today. It's not happening. All right, we got the Uncommon at 2018 editions, 2018. We got the Purple Rare at 1418. Are we still good? I feel like I froze or something. Let me put this over here again. Pokemon are still here, so we must be fine. All right, we got the Deadpool looking Ultra Rare with less than 1,000 editions, 918. Command attention with Rosso Epona. And then we got the Black Secret Rare, 618 editions. First public. Ooh, I didn't even realize that when I did my serial numbers to look for. I guess I got to refresh my chat there, apparently. Killed my chat. What's up, Muhammad in the house? The green doesn't suit the Aventador. It's more of a Huracan color. I agree it looks better on Huracan. That's Happy Tears. Not today it ain't. Not with these prices on my crypto. But a uh, first public on the Secret Rare is 21 today. It's not 41. Oh, so it's on this... Ultra Rare too. I didn't realize that. Is it on all of them? No. So just the Ultra Rare and the Secret Rare. So the one to snipe today is Ultra Rares. That's what I'm sniping today for sure. Ultra Rares. I'm not going to pay more than retail for one. But if it's sub 50 serial number, that did not realize that. First public on the Ultra Rares is 21. That's interesting. That could make things interesting. All right. I'm in there. I'm not buying one, but I went ahead and joined the wait list because why not what happens first cash out on cryptoids or vvverse oh cryptoids cash out for sure vvverse is never happening i feel like vvverse vvverse is it's it's a it's it's a legend it's not really gonna happen oh we're on fire I'm trying to catch up with the chat my chat was freezing up for me trying to watch that video I see the biggest bro said something, but then my screen caught on fire and I can't read it. Shakes are just redeemed fire. There you go. <laughs> There's KCB. We're showing your, uh, we were showing your calendar a second ago. Oh, no, I got to go up here. It's time for some fo oh, live FOMO. I know I'm, I'm in 
I'm in the queue, and you know when it pops up and says buy now, my FOMO is going to kick in. I'm trying not to. I don't want to buy today, but it's hard to resist the buy now button. Not sure sniping will be good today. Probably won't sell a ton of them. I'm thinking the ultra rares could be good sniping if we can get some sub 50s. Since the lowest serial number is number 21, we got drunk zombies. That's the first. Zombies and they're drunk at the same time. Let's go. Is the volume working on those? Gangsters in the house. What's up, gangster? Ultra and Secret Rare first available mint is 21. I didn't realize that till just now. Cash out is happening on Cryptoids. When? Can I get a W E N? Being super careful today. Is there a secondary market for Cryptoids? Not yet, but apparently the secondary market for Cryptoids opens in June. That's what everyone's saying. All right, let's get a let's get a little bit of coffee going. Let's get a little smoky smoke, and then we'll be ready. To do some sniping. I'm not buying this. Although I do have 280 gems. I'm trying to get to 500 so I can cash some out. I still got my desk. Poor desk is not doing much. Oh, it's dropping. I thought this was going to pump. But we got Mr. Moonboy, WC3NTE, who's a super moon boy on Twitter, flooring all his desks. It doesn't sound very, like a very moon boyish thing to do. Two minutes before the drop begins, let's check the poll. Would be awesome to sell a sealed package, a sealed package on Cryptoids. That would be awesome if you could do that. You can do that on Candy. Let's go for it and hope for that secret rare. Come on, Booty Jays, do not talk me into this. Please don't. Somebody just spent a bunch of vault cash for the Aston Martin. Let's go. All right, looks like 68% of the chat say no. They're not going for this. 32% say they're gonna gamble today. I'm gonna try to resist. I'm gonna try to resist. Dane K's got that Aston Martin money. All right, one minute and 30 seconds. Speaking of Aston Martin money, where's Big A at? He actually bought an Aston Martin in real life. Gangster is trying to warn me. Real Goku is going for it. I'm not going for it. I'm trying not to go for it. There's the FUD. Did I FUD it? Was it me? Did I FUD something? I said I almost was going to go for it. <laughs> Shakespeare's going to gamble on this one. Resist. I know, I know. Did not go for this. My name is Gary, and I'm from Daytona, Florida. Oh, that is my least favorite beach in Florida. Daytona, we went to Daytona Beach. And not only is it so crowded, everybody's driving their vehicles on the beach. You gotta drive two miles down the beach just to find a parking spot. And then everything is overpriced. No, go to Pensacola. Panama City Beach is my favorite because I'm ghetto like that. Do not pay 70, I'm picking up the green for 28. You'll probably get it less than 28. All right, y'all, it's almost time for the drop to begin. What if I went for it and I get, did get a secret rare? Big A's on a Sunday morning drive. He was in here earlier. We got the OG Deb and Bill Tosin saying, resist. You must resist. Yes, I'm going to resist. We can bet. I will bet 10K you won't hit the secret rare. That's a tough bet. I'm going to say no. Fort Lauderdale Beach is okay, but Hollywood Beach is the best in Florida. I think I've been to Hollywood. I'm trying to remember what beach we went to in California. It was like, started with an H, and it was pretty nice. It was a whole... I don't know, it's like the Pacific Ocean is way different than the Atlantic Ocean to me. It was colder. Maybe it was the season, I don't know. Allocating. It says allocating. Maybe I wasn't selected. Tom Tom says buy one. I'm trying not to. Guys, I tried to join the Discord link, but it says, and yeah. Sorry about that. I'll give you a link. I haven't updated that link in my details in like 20 years. Maybe not 20 years. At least a year. So I'll have to give you a new one. There says, I did the link that says it would never expire, but it, they do expire. I'm assuming I did get picked even though I haven't been able to grab it yet. Kurizimi in the house. Let's go. Got the number 45. Let me get the chat so I can give you the link. Here's the link to join the Discord. I'll try to update that on my next, uh, before my next stream. Daniel D got selected. Don't click the buy button. Huntington Beach, biggest bro knows everything. All I gotta do from now on, I'm not asking the chat. I'm gonna just ask the biggest bro. Yes, hunting the beach. That is the beach we went to. Exactly. I've been bearish on VVverse ever since I seen Kid Arcade selling his Avengers Tower for under floor. Yeah, I think Kid Arcade has uh, early access, so he would know. Clearwater Beach. That, that's another good one. Whoops. Gangster. I'm trying to keep up. Gangster One. The original botters. Uncommon for Captain Obvious. She gambled and she lost. That's why I'm not buying. I'm assuming I got selected. Let me go back. There we go. I did get selected. I got my buy now button. I'm not going to click it. Kerr got the Trump mint. What's the Trump mint? I didn't know there was a Trump mint. Where's Kerr? Oh, number 45. Oh, brother. I guess that is the Trump mint. Sell that crap. 
83 for Ledges, got a two digit. Autumn says, if this is like last unsold, Lambo Secret Rare will be 200 ish in a few days. Maybe. I know, sometimes you gotta back out when it just says allocating like that, Ali. I knew I had gotten selected. Yeah, just refresh when it says allocating. Got selected, but I don't think I'm gonna buy them the same. Nimble says back out. Yes, that did work. Does Kid Arcade have access to the Vverse? I'm pretty sure he does. Slack Rex got a rare number 257. Yeah, I'm assuming it needs a lot more work. What's up, Conan? Got an ultra rare. Let me get a big congratulations on that. Let's go. Larry Mackins with the uncommon number 588. I'll show you the serial numbers to look for. Tang Ma says, Low Mint Mick thinking he could put his 1K Stormtroopers in the VVverse that made him realize the cap possibility in a recent post. And he asked the question, David Yu, is the VVverse capped? No answer. I don't know if it would be capped, but there's probably a limit to how much. I don't know. You should be able to put everything in there, right? You might be right. There might be a limit. We got Frank Sabaka hit the drop with no MCB points and just closed the app instead. That might be the right move to make. Unless you got a secret rare. I haven't seen any secret rares in the chat yet, but somebody got that Trump number 45. That's going to be worth more than retail. Ice Tank took an L on this one. Arcade is on the list. Yes, he is. I can book a motel for a day instead of this. That is a good point. That is a good point. 70 is quite a bit. Kid Arcade is a member of the VV list along with a few other users in the chat. Yeah, not all the Moon Boys hate me. Most of them do. I've been blocking a lot of Moon Boys on Twitter this week. Even blocked Crypto Khaki. He's a big My Collectibles Maybe fan. I can't take the My Collectibles good. fans. If you like that dude, unsubscribe from me, please. No See good. ya. Uh, comment number 2008. Is it worth something? Yes. Uh, more than floor. But the floor is going to be really low. I don't think it's going to be more than retail. We should spam Kid Arcade until he tells us what the Vverse looks like. He's not allowed. He's not allowed to do that. He signed a NDA. KCB says the first four that were minted on IMX were all secret rares. That seems sus. That seems very sus. The first four that were minted, well, who got them? Randy Chavez, my collectibles. Who else got one? Mr. MC1 got one, I'm sure. Price predictions, I'll show you those again. We got Pink Panther in the house. Let's go. McCann did, do all, did all right. Got an ultra rare number 468. I still think that's going to be below retail. All right, let me show Mr. Peter the price predictions. Pull that up there. And we'll show you the price predictions. Uh, you can go for rebounds. I don't know why you would in 10 minutes. All right, price predictions for today. We only got like four. Oliver said he put price predictions in here too, up higher, but I could not find them. I looked too. I looked everywhere. All right, price predictions for today. Starting off with Bilby. He's got 25 on the uncommon, 30 on the rare, 50 on the ultra rare, and 180 on the secret rare. Ultra rare for Chasm. I think ultra rares, I mean, you're not losing much, but you're probably still losing. Moquilly thinks all under retail, and then secret rare at 540. McCann's got 22, 28, 58, and 250 on the secret rare. I got 19, 25, 39, and 125. I do think 125 was too low. Now that we've looked at the secret rares of the Mercia Lago and a couple of the other recent Lamborghini drops. I think Secret Rare could go to 200, maybe 180, at least 150. Dan K's got 30, 80, 55, and 230. And if this doesn't sell out, which I don't think it will, then some of these uncommon and rare and ultra rare prices will be a little bit higher than I have here because there's not going to be as many people to floor. There are no comments today. Secret Rare will settle at 200 by end of week. You might be right. Secret Rare, why do I always get the Secret Rare like I can't lose on VV? Opposite of Shadow Band. Must be nice. <laughs> Apparently Pink Panther is whitelisted. You block on Twitter? Yes, I block everybody on Twitter. I got David U blocked. I got Dan Crowthers blocked. I don't even care. When's the next batch of VVverse beta invites going out? Oh, uh, yeah, what, they talked about that. When's the, um... How, how long did they say that there was going to be an ambassadors program? They've said that for three years now. Is there an ambassador program? No, they just hire the moon boys. Amin says, I can't buy. Why? You should be able to buy. I'm sure these aren't sold out. Do you have 70 gems? Are you uh, KYC'd? I'm telling you, VV rigs the blind box. I agree. You didn't believe me when I tried to warn you. I know. I never listened to the Yizzo, and I should. Nimble's got price predictions of 20, 30, 35, 50, and 150. There's only four today. So it's one too many price predictions. We'll take off the 20 and say you got 30 on the uncommon, 35 on the rare, 50 on the ultra rare, and 150 on the secret rare. Who got Ecomi secret rare? I've heard those have been going up. The logos, the secret rare logos, that's the common. That's the rare. 
guess we have to go down here to find it. I heard they've been pumping. I don't have one. I got no Omi tokens. I'm not interested in Omi tokens. All right, the secret rare is at, ooh, 1,700. I think it was 1,200 last week when we checked. There's Sergio. He got one. The rest are all really cheap, though. I don't know if that makes up for your 95% loss of investment. Too many additions compared to Kuntosh. I agree. A lot of these flippers are owners of multiple accounts. Yes, I agree with that also. We got the OG Wise Grouch, my former poker partner player. We're going to be playing some poker today in the Discord using Poker Stars. You can play on your PC or mobile app. We, we usually do a, a buy in of $10 each, winner takes all. I got mint number 57. Let's go. I think you'll be lucky to get retail for it. I'd try to get 99. You might have to go all the way down to 70. There we go. There's a secret rare in the chat. Odie got one. Odie with number 247 on the secret rare. Congratulations. We need a gym bell out. We need a gym bell out. We need airdrops. What happened to like OG users getting airdrops from Vivi? Just like all the other projects. All the other projects give OG users airdrops. Let me turn this down. We never said anything to me though. Oh, missed, I missed that one. Tom Tom. All right, we got a Pokemon in the chat. Randy Chavez never said anything wrong. Bro, if all the whales bought as many times as Randy Chavez says the whales were buying, we'd all be rich right now. Click into the bluegrass stamp. Oh, I heard those sold out. I was surprised they sold out. I didn't even stream that drop. I was like, I'm not a big fan of bluegrass or stamps. So, all right, we got the ultra rares. Two gems for the ultra rare. How many are there? Oh, well, there's 3,000. They made a lot of those. Were those. Was it only two rarities? An ultra rare and a secret rare? Secret rare is at $23.99. I'm assuming it was seven gems. No, six gems retail. So I guess if you got the secret rare, you did all right. Ultra rare is only two jimmies, though. That's cheap. Cheap, cheap. Never could watch my collectibles. He sounds like a kindergarten teacher. Seems a little fake to me. DLC says, my thoughts. If we are all signed up and we are active users, then we should all be eligible to use things like the BBverse and not selected by certain individuals. Exactly. PokerStars only works in three states. That's not true. That's not true at all. PokerStars? No, not true. Not true at all. Secret Rare Mints, Secret Rare Mints, 616-329-147-466 were the first ones minted. 616 first. Yeah, check names as soon as you can. BE says Mints. Yeah, let me show the Mints. Why do you have time for buying? What does this mean? I don't Oh, because I got selected. I got five minutes left to buy. Does the vehicle have music? If so, that'd be actually pretty cool. All right, let me show you the mints to look for today. Don't have a lot of special mints to look for, but 1963, and I think it's only available on the Uncommon, the same as 1916. Those both should do pretty well, especially 1963. And really, number 63, I didn't think about it, but number 63 might do well today, too. I got number 41 as the lowest serial number, but actually on the Ultra Rare and the Secret Rare, number 21 is the lowest serial number today. You got 2018, 1418, 918, and 618. Oh, you're saying the stamps have music? Bluegrass music? Oh, that's the worst kind of music possible. It makes me not want to buy them. Should I hit the buy now button? I would say no. Not financial advice. Picked up an ultra rare for two gems. That is good MCP points for two gems. True. Very true. UPS always sells out. Yeah, because there are only six gems. There's some comic, I mean, some stamp collectors out there. I definitely don't think things are random in anything. I don't either. The bluegrass stamp has, oh, the bluegrass stamp has music. Yeah, but that's got to be bad music, right? It's blast watching those who used to promote VB so hard now flip and hate it so much. That's what we do. They started it. I ain't, I ain't afraid to hate on VB. Do it all the time. Why do you have time to buy? So how it works? Amini? I want to say Amini, but I'm probably pronouncing it as bad as I pronounce Autumn. But so whenever you, the wait list starts, if you are selected, you can see it says right here, you have 15 minutes to make your purchase. I have not bought one yet. So I still have three minutes and 47 seconds to change my mind and buy one. Then whenever this timer hits zero minutes and zero seconds, you will have a chance to buy a second one if you've already bought one for the rebound. And then five minutes after that, the market will open on these and you can buy and sell them in the market. That would be cool if we could hear the engine. Whoops. Even funnier when I mute it boom, <laughs> and click unmute and see they switch sides. That does happen a lot. I know there's a couple people that I used to call Moon Boys, and now they're more footers than I am. How much do you think Ultra Rare number 45 will go for? I mean, if you get a Trump supporter to buy it, since it's apparently the Trump number, it should do pretty well, Curzi. I mean, I'm thinking if the Ultra Rares are sitting around 40 or 50, and you got number 45, 200, 
150 to 200 would be my guess. Not financial advice. You will be in the bad side of town in VV verse pimping out Harley Quinn and Minnie Mouse. That's probably true. I can see that happening. I won't be in the VV verse. It's never happening. You gotta be a moon boy to get in. I want to see the marketplace before I buy. Says Alejandro. That's a good point. You will be able to. Oh, actually, you don't. It used to be we could see the marketplace before you buy within that 15 minutes of getting selected, but not anymore. But then again, if these aren't sold out, you can look at the marketplace and go back and buy one. And if not that many sold, then the prices might be higher than they should be, and it might be worth it to go and buy one. I wish I could see now how many have sold and how many haven't. We used to have a little trick of doing that, but I don't think it works anymore. See, it just says calculating. Now, the trick used to be we would go in here and type in, like, Aventador. And it used to tell us right there where it says calculating how many actually sold. But I guess I did that live too many times, and VB saw it and was like, oh, we got to fix that. So now we still cannot see how many have sold and how many haven't sold for another few more minutes. What's going on here? Oh, there it is. One minute and 57 seconds left to buy. Interesting to see that my time is different to yours. Well, there's going to be um, like 10 seconds, maybe like 7 seconds of lag on the stream. There's always lag on the stream, so always watch your own clocks. Yeah, yeah. Oh, 35 seconds. There shouldn't be no 35 seconds. Definitely shouldn't be that bad of lag. I don't know. Where you at? What, what country are you in? Maybe your country has some lag. What's up with Vverse? When is it launching? It's already launched. Vverse has been around for a while, but you have to be a major moon boy, and you have to have lost tens of thousands of dollars on the app for you to have access. Otherwise, you can't you can't get in. And yet, here we are. Yes, sir. Even live TV isn't live? That's true. They usually have a delay. Not always. But most live TV has the delay. All right, we'll be doing some sniping on this one here in about six minutes, five minutes after the timer hits zero. I am getting more interested in VV. I miss the fun times. Yeah, a lot of people are talking about how they're having so much fun collecting and VV is so much fun, so they don't care about the prices going down. I don't understand what's the, what's, what's the fun part. I mean, sniping can be fun, but they're not snipers. So what exactly... How are they having fun? Playing in their vault? Is that really that much fun? Uh-oh, Digital Verse says, all respect, rather you in the space than not. I do like positivity though in general. general. May I ask what made you buy your first NFT on the platform? Has that reason changed? I saw the vision. I, everybody gave me that vision of, in the future, it's gonna be like Ready Player One. That was the thing. It was gonna be Ready Player One. And we're all gonna have to own our own digital collectibles and then all the other people are going to get into Ready Player One, and they're going to want the first ever Batman, so they're going to have to buy it from me, and it's going to be worth a bunch more. But then what had happened was the prices went way, way up, and I held on to my stuff because I believed in it, and then VB didn't deliver anything that they said they were going to deliver. No big exchanges, no VBverse, no nothing. And then the prices went down, and all the smart people sold their stuff and left and made lots of money. And I waited too long to sell my stuff. I still sold my stuff like over a year ago and made some good money. Not a moon boy. And that's true. Autumn is on the list. But you're a big spender though. Kryptoni says there are those that chose to play the game and some that chose to talk trash from the sidelines. I chose to play and win, lose, or draw. There you go. I tr talk trash from the sidelines. I think it must suck, suck badly that... And those are beta testers. I think if it was any good, the VBverse, we'd all have access right now. That's just what I think. Master Moo says, is there a reason why you not buy and sell meme coins on the photon instead of using Shuriken on the photon? No, like just Shuriken. The thing I like about Shuriken is that it tells me how much I'm up. Like if I'm up 200% or if I'm down 10%. But honestly, they take more than the 1% that they say they're taking. So I'm going to start using photon or some other method to buy and sell. But I haven't been buying and selling any meme coins on Solana because the market's been down so bad. I've been keeping my eye on it and there's nothing really worth buying recently. Whenever the market starts coming back up, and it might start coming back up this week, then I might go ahead and start streaming some of those Solana meme coin streams again. Whoops. BJN said bad drop today. Yes. Hunting interesting and collecting is still very fun for me. Oh, hunting investing and collecting is still very fun for me. I guess. I don't I don't have that much fun with it anymore. Do you not think a Ready Player One verse won't exist? Yes, I do. And I think it'll be made by Disney and Epic Games and will have nothing to do with VV. Could be wrong though. Not financial advice. Photon does two. Well, does two and updates each second. Do they take 1%? Yeah, I might just start buying on Photon. I do like the Photon website. 
made a profit, but not the 140k my vault went to because I chose to trust VV exactly and wait for legal cash out. Being upset makes me a bad guy. See, this right here. That's the reason why some of us are like, what the heck? David, you mind sucks and everyone has good ideas. Ready Player One idea is smart. Yeah, but they, they can't they can't come through with anything they promise. There has to be an audience. Everyone can't be LeBron. I didn't even know a VVverse was in the cards when I joined. I signed up so I could have a shot at getting Homer and Bart. And the Disney stuff makes sense. As long as Disney goes hard on the Web3, Disney's going to be the FAs that you want to have. Elsa, Iron Man. VV is under no obligation to extend invites to the VVverse to everyone. In fact, I know a few people that I would keep out of the VVverse entirely. I think he's talking about me. What are you doing in my stream, Matthew Lambie? There's no Moon Boy streaming today? <laughs> I can't help to laugh at your kid in the back. I know. He's, he's having a good time. All right, here's something I do want to show y'all, though. Here you go, Matthew Lambie. See if you like this one. Just keep in mind, folks, that if you look into the new terms of service released by VV, it says very plain and clearly here, you agree that all title and interest uh, in our services and all content is the property of Orbis Technology. That is the parent company of VV and Ecomi. It says, if you go down a little bit, all property and intellectual property, the software, the underlying system, all information, data, text, graphics, artwork, photographers, oh, sorry, what? why did I say photographers? Photographs, trademarks, logos, sound recordings, videos, all of it, everything belongs to Orbis. You own nothing. So what are we buying? What are we buying here? You own nothing. That doesn't sound like an NFT to me. How's your profit rate for the SoCoins? Maybe I should hop on the streams if they do good. Well, lately it's not been doing too well for me, but I haven't been buying a lot lately. But when the market is going up, I do pretty well. It, it'll be like, I'll be like 50% on them, but the ones that I don't do good on the Solana meme coins, I'll put in like $15 and take out $10 because I can see it's going down. So I only lose $5, but on the ones I do good, I double and triple my money. So overall, it's a winning bet. This ain't selling out. I agree. Oh, only invest what you can afford to lose. I agree. Let Jess, let's go in for a second. We've got the ultra rare. I haven't seen many secret rares in the chat today. The irony that Disney would partner with Epic when VV was with them prior to that. I mean, why don't they just give money to the VV or get their people to help me? That's a good point. I guess they don't think that VV can handle it. I mean, they also partnered with Cryptoys and Dapper Labs. Only Americans can make VV right now. What does that mean? Cashed out like 37K. Let's go. They talk about me on X. That's why I got them all muted. What do you have to say about me? I don't want me. There's not much to say. I'm pretty, I'm an open book. The terms also say they do not have to invite everyone to the VVverse. Is that a good thing? Do you think that's a good thing? Diesel says, Vision agreed. We lost vault profit, not our investment. You said he cooled the market on purpose. That is true. He did say that. Thinking I was going to be a part of Ready Player One made me feel like a nerd. I'd rather just collect collectibles. I don't think it's very nerdy. Did you see the movie? The movie was dope. It could happen. All right, market's going to be opening up on these in about 30 seconds. Keep in mind that my clock is different than yours. There's a little bit of lag on the stream. So watch your own clock. Usually takes about 20, 30 seconds. Calm down, kid. 20 or 30 seconds after the top of the minute, 11.20, my time, before they start popping up on the market. I almost wanted to buy a Sakura. I did buy a Sakura for a while, then I sold it. Does it show how many were burnt yet? Yeah, about a little bit over half were burnt less than a thousand of those it's not not enough to jump into it we may at our discretion allow you to have access to the vverse from the terms of service i mean why would they not give everybody access to the vverse who's going to stick around if they don't have access to the vverse and everybody else does that's ridiculous we got richie rich in the house let's go what's up richie rich and stacy rich i'm assuming she has the last name as you right stacy rich and richie rich i think i want to snipe ultra rares today because I don't think everybody knows that the lowest serial number on these is 21. Maybe you can get lucky and get a sub 50 serial number for a good price. And right now, I think the floor is 63. Other serial numbers to look for, 1963 is the one to go for. I think 1916, I want to say 1916 is a good one. Let me just pull these up again. Hey, I seen me. I'm selling my Sakura. Oh. If JOC is selling, then I ain't buying. 1963 is the one to go for. Also, 1916 today. Look for that 350. The right to access all or certain parts of the VVerse may be restricted or refused by us. Yeah. People they don't like don't get to play. That seems like a crappy way to do things, personally. Could be wrong. They put it in that terms because they want to keep you out, Vault. I know. That's what I thought, too. 
BB versus in beta, is that hard to understand? It's not hard to understand, but I feel like it's been in beta for a long time. So if it was really any, any good, they would have let everybody in by now. All right, let's go check all the prices, I guess, before we start sniping. Secret rare is starting off at 400 jimmies. I think it'll go down from there. Rare is starting off at 33. And the uncommon green Aventador starting off pretty high at 30. My plan is to snipe this ultra rares. I think it'll go down to 40 to 50 gems. But I'm hoping I could get maybe a sub 50 serial number for our floor. Elias says, not been here in a while. How is the market looking since Bitcoin? Nah. Had my exit from the Vverse in 2022. Man, you exited at the right time, my friend. Prices have been dropping. Drop, drop, dropping. I think my collectibles used to get upset at people for selling their ultra rare Vaders for 1200. He said it would never drop below a thousand. Current floor is under 300. So he got a job. Chad Chandler says Readyverse has partnered with Warner Brothers. Readyverse. Ready Player One is on the way. Yeah, I don't think it's called Readyverse, but I know what you're talking about. I tried to join them and I was tr trying to jump in and get some of their collectibles. There's Kurazimi. Some of their NFTs, but the NFTs have already been on the market for a while. Futureverse, I think, is what it's called. And they're pretty expensive. The disclaimer was for people who chose to be obscene in the VVverse. Gotta remember, these are the Disney collectibles. That's true, you can't be obscene. I'm losing my faith in VV. But then again, they're the ones that dropped the Dragon Girls and the Bull... The Bull... How, I mean, what's that one girl's name? The one that's half naked or fully naked. We're not the ones that created that collectible and put it on the app. I'm losing faith in VV. Been at this for almost three years and the user base has only shrunk, not grown. Yeah, they need more users, and I don't see how they can get more users, personally. I wonder what will happen with my collectibles NFT project. It's pretty extensive. He works for Vivi now. Nah, who knows? Who cares? I always thought it was kind of shady for him to be selling trashy-looking NFTs just for his own personal profit. Missed 1963 for 30. Oh, whoever got that, that was a good snipe. AF15, yeah. Ink Stories, that's the one I'm thinking of. You're right. There's a rabbit walking off the song. Walk, there's a what? There's a rabbit walking off song. Oh, a new uh, a new Ron English song, maybe? Interesting. Still looking at the ultra rares. Floor is at 55. I'm looking for like sub, sub 40 serial numbers, honestly. If I can get a sub 40 for 100 or less, that's a buy for me. The lowest serial number on these today is 21. Same as the secret rare. There's 299. I need to check to see what the highest serial number is. I think it's 918. Yeah, 918 is the highest ultra rare. Less than 30% sold so far. Vader would be a buy, but VV has zero plans to market to Star Wars fans. I mean, I feel like they should market to Star Wars fans more. And I can't believe, thank you, Biggest Bro always got the answers. Bullheaded Dirty Trooper. I mean, how can we not be obscene when there's a Bullheaded Dirty Trooper on the app? But yeah, I think Vader is one of the, I don't want to say it, but kind of one of the most undervalued undervalued collectibles it's a fader first appearance 1963 dropped for 25 autumn says that 1963 was bought it how do y'all know i hear people say that all the time whenever something pops up for a super low price and nobody snipes it they're always like the bot got it i don't know do we still have bots like what bot is taking their time to bot vv at this point i feel like there's better stuff to bot to spend your bot time on David Yu doesn't know how to use a toaster. His mind is bets mode. Bets mode. Beta mode. Oh, I got you. Vivi never addresses legitimate user concerns or questions. That's the biggest problem. They used to do AMAs. They used to do the... I don't even remember what they're called anymore, but they used to do it like monthly sit-down with David Yu and Dan Crothers. <coughs> Community update, I think is what it was called. They stopped doing that too. They were like, we never have anything to say. I'm out, y'all. Have a great day. All right, Daniel C., thanks for hanging out. Remember, we got a few drops this week. BE will be streaming those drops over on the Informant YouTube channel. VV and Alex refuses to pay Disney to put a QR code in their movies and shows with IP. Yeah, I don't think they would want to pay for that. They won't even pay for exchanges. I think that's the whole reason we're not on big exchanges. They just don't want to pay. I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. I don't know a lot about exchanges, but that's what I've heard people say. I'm going to go back and check some of these prices. Vision says, I triple and quadruple my comics and doing so now with select items like Batman, Killer Croc, as the real world collectibles are through the roof. Convergence, you're crushing it, bro. I bet you spent 999 for the Batman versus Killer Croc statue and now it's worth 30 gems. You're crushing it, bro. No, actually, that was me. 
I, I bought one for nine hundred ninety nine. Well, actually, if you didn't know, uh, Lambie has a reason. I think his wife works for VB, if I'm not mistaken. That's what I was told. Disney sucks. They will destroy this. We need a new leader and someone with a brain. I don't know. I don't know enough about business to to comment on it. I mean, they keep adding new people. They said they had a blockchain expert. Where's that person? They keep they keep hiring VV YouTubers, but where's that blockchain expert at? All right, this was at 400 a minute ago. We're down to 222. I think it goes a little bit lower. Not too much. I don't think it's going to go below 150. 39 on the purple, and the uncommon is at 30. Let's see how many were sold. 58 is the floor, so 600. So, yeah, about 33% something like that so that's how many are sold so these are not selling out today in my opinion maybe if the prices were a little higher it would entice people to go and buy blind boxes but I don't think at these prices anybody's buying them pull the trigger except for lead Jess. <laughs> let's go we pulled the trigger for a third and got the secret rare that's what I'm talking about I don't know why he did that but it worked he likes to gamble what's up Tony Dolce this drop is not even close to selling out I agree they have zero interest in paying to market to new users. I agree. Go to moment still the top tier collectibles. Cashed out my R2D2 for about 5k. Where's the price at the moment? Oh, you don't want to know. It's very, very low. There's too many additions of those. Although I agree, the first thing to pump when the market pumps are the Disney Golden Moments. But there are just so many. Elsa is one of my favorites. I wish I had an Elsa. You seen the new Marvel Coca-Cola app with AR? Looks like fire, bro. No. Are those NFTs? What's that about? Coca-Cola app with AR. You put your Coke in AR? I think I saw something about that, where if you put like your Coke bottle in front of your phone using the app, it does some crazy stuff. They won't pay exchanges and no big investor will buy only. It's all owned by David and Dan. Everything's owned by David and Dan. That's why I showed you that terms of service, even your NFTs. Your NFTs. Went from AMA to DAMN. Don't ask me nothing. That's exactly true. I've seen his giant fat head. Feel bad for the wife. What? I don't know who you're talking about, but that didn't seem very nice. Just woke up, missed the drop. What's up, G Metals? You did not miss much, my friend. Right now, the secret rare is at like two, was it 250? 255. Ultra rare is at 50. Well, it's actually going up a little bit. It's at 60. I'm sniping ultra rares because the lowest serial number on the ultra rares is 21. So somebody, maybe somebody will post like a sub 40 for floor, and I can snipe it up and make a quick profit. Although I don't see that happening, especially since only about 30 to 33% have sold. I agree with that, gangster. Those people used to say, VV is going to make us all rich. I don't see that happening at this point. Secret Rare is already at 250. That's true. Yeah, Adam is... Uh, I said Adam again. Autumn is pretty good at the price predictions. We used to do a price prediction challenge where whoever got the closest... Uh, whoever got the closest on the drops for the month ended up getting a prize. But then people stopped doing it. And I lost, I lost interest. Coca-Cola Marvel. Coca-Cola Marvel? Huh, I'm going to have to check that out for sure. Been collecting comics since 1974. Was laughed at then and was laughing back now. Phoebe has not lived up to the get-rich-quick folks, but the, for people like me with thousands of comics and collectibles in real life, I mean, long-term, it makes sense that it could happen, but I'm skeptical because if Disney and Epic Games puts out their own metaverse, then it's going to leave Phoebe in the dust. I mean, is the Phoebeverse going to be able to compete? Whenever they're just making a making a template from Cavernous, something that Spatial has already done, I don't know. VV is too fragile now; it can collapse. So I think just leave it as is now. Disney laid off their Metaverse team a year ago. I did hear about that. We'll be keeping my eye on this space during the oops Bitcoin Extreme bull run. Might see some more activity in the VV NFT market. It's possible, but I'm not going to be like putting my money into Omi tokens. That's for sure. Just because crypto is starting to go up. I'll be buying other stuff. I don't want to miss the bull run like I did last time when I bought all my tokens and everything else went up. Metaverse was a stupid idea. Second Life being around a long time. No one's interested. I don't know. I hate VVOGs, all of them except for Fall. <laughs> Thank you, Goku, I guess. And all the girls, too. You like all the girls, right? I'll save the screenshot for later. Cheers, mate. Keep making that money. You might be right. And I might be wrong. Who knows? Can't read the future. VV is on his deathbed since Billy Bob Bitcoin, and he used to be a... I wouldn't say a moon boy, but he was always very bullish. I'm just here to give my condolences to the loved ones. Rest in peace. All right. I have not seen any of those sub 50s at the market yet. I saw Kurazimi with number 45, I think is who had it. Backdoor Kicks got number 62. Floor is under 60. There's 333. 
I want like number 21 or 22, 23, get that Michael Jordan mint number. But I have not seen it hit the market yet. I'd be willing to pay up to 100, 120 for a sub 40 just so I could flip it for a profit. Been trying to sell my remaining collection for months. Zero buyers in the secondary. It's tough to, it's tough to, to get stuff sold. Yeah, BE's sniping too. He doesn't see any good mints. Me neither. Do you still have belief in VV since you are still making these videos? Most of the OG VV YouTubers are gone. No, I have no belief in VV. Ever since they hired my collectibles, it's like, no. Not interested at all. But I still do the streams because I like hanging out with the homies and going for drops and making fun of VV together. That's what we do now. That's our entertainment. We laugh at VV together as a group. <laughs> Some decentralized metaverse will have AIs creating environments with any collectible you can think of. These are worthless than the digital files they are stored on. BB Comey is one of the, the only crypto that has no tech and has no giveaways for long time holders. Well, they just gave giveaways away to Omi holders. If you had it in the app, you got one of those Omi logo collectibles and the Comey logo collectibles and the Secret Rare. We just checked on it during the stream is at 1700. So that could have been like a $1,700 giveaway. We got How to Brain in the House. What's up, my man? Was this drop worse than you expected? Yes. I thought it would sell like 50%, but it only sold like 30%. What'd you tag me in? Yes, they did. All you gotta do is lie. I mean, not lie, but be fake and say that everything that VV does is great and awesome, and you will be getting a job. I feel bad for Randy Chavez. He's kissed more butt for a longer time than my collectibles. He didn't get hired. Don't ask me. I don't know why. All right, somebody said to check my Twitter. I don't know if I should. It's nothing bad, is it? All right, let's check my Twitter and see what I got tagged in by Hammy. It's Hammy. Can't be that bad. Looks like the bots are already at work. I do. I don't see anything from Hammy. Oh, there it is. Blake Me Cakes. Let's see what Blake Me Cakes is talking about. Oh, yeah, this is the new Coca-Cola digital app and Metaverse. Kicks off with new AR Marvel digital collectibles. What? What? Go back up here my collection all characters i'm trying to check this out this is pretty interesting assemble the marvel universe okay <clears throat> let's see he says he got it a box expecting an assortment of the 38 heroes but it's one per box on every can inside you can unlock the collectible heroes on the app and view them in ar by scanning the qr codes <laughs> Man, I like this is the end for vv <laughs> they're going to be giving you yeah here you go you can see it right here AR collectibles, but are they on the blockchain? I guess not. Does it need to be on the blockchain? I think they're leaving the blockchain behind with this, and they look like they're pretty well made. I haven't heard about this till just now. Hamie always with the alpha. That is true. Hamie got the alpha for y'all. Interesting. I didn't know that was a thing. All right, yeah, that's very interesting. He's creating his account, show some of the stuff you can do here. Exploration, visits, brand discovery. I'm going to have to get this today. His current level was Fizz. That's interesting. Oh, we can see one of the collectibles here. There's your avatars. I got to be I gotta be Deadpool, no doubt. And then, oh my goodness. Check this out. This is Daredevil. Whoops. Sorry, this might be lagging a little bit because I'm trying to pull up this. What? Looks better than VV? What do you say? I'm not saying it looks better. I'm asking, does it look better than VV? It's a little proportioned. His proportions aren't too great. Torso is longer than his legs. I don't know. I don't know, man. That's rough. That's scary for VV, in my opinion. Let me know what y'all think. I mean, where VV gives out Omi tokens or something, I staked Omi and they took away the APR. Yeah, I did see that. People got upset about that. I still believe in VV and Omi, but I... I'm on the OG Vault team. Thank you, Thanu. Yeah, VV, a lot of big VV collectors who still are bullish with VV still hang out at my live streams because I don't know why. It's fun. The drops are more fun than anything else. Buying a bunch of stuff for no reason is not that fun. Do you want to come up here? Come here. Oh, we got a fat cat hanging out with us. We got cats back there fighting it's getting wild my kids in there playing games going crazy biggest bro are you guys going live over there on kid arcades channel at the top of the hour so me sharing this 
is seen as FUD. Imagine how their bags are hurting. How is that FUD? That's just factual. That's a thing that's happening right now. And I mean, I don't know how it affects VB if they're not NFTs, though. We're not listed on exchanges is because of FUD. I know. That's what, uh, that's what David Yu told everybody. We're not on big exchanges because of the FUD. So I guess it's my fault. Exactly. Got to kick it with the homies at least once a week. I'm no fudder, but I expose call BS. I'm a huge VB in um, McFarland toys, DC Maybe collector, and constantly call them out. Good. Yeah, I called out. I'm a, that's probably my biggest bag that is that on candy.com DC, no but good. I called out the fact that the Prez guy seems to get like number uh, one mints fathers. all the time. Autumn knows about that. More like 9.15. Okay, so about 15 minutes after the top of the hour, the biggest bro is going live over on the Kid Arcade YouTube channel. Let's go. Let me go back a little bit and see if anybody else had anything to say about that. David is a poor business owner. He hoards cash and does not grow. Is he hoarding cash? Maybe he's a cash collector. Maybe that's what he collects. He says he's a collector. A collector of cash. Listing Star Wars number one for zero, zero, zero in one minute. Wait, what? In one minute? That's not a very long time. All right. Star I don't even know if I can find that. Is it trending? I hope it's trending. Star Wars number is not trending. I'm never going to find this in time. I'm assuming this is a comic. Star Wars number one. See the lag? Okay, that's Darth Maul. Star Wars number one, 1977. It's this one. It's got to be this one. Oh, if you see what I'm talking about, y'all. Let me pull it up here again. It could be popping up any second. Oh, this is one of the good ones, too. He's, you can't list it for zero dollars and zero cents. You can list it for one. We got no market. Who got no market? Why you got no market? I'm in there. I'm ready to go. If it pops up, I'm going to try to snipe it before anybody else can get to it. Of course, we got BE and KCB and Kurizimi, all the top snipers in the chat. So it might be hard to get. But then again, they might be busy sniping Lambos. And they're not going to go for this. I'm ready. I might have missed it already. It took me like a minute to find it. Is it even a common? I don't even know if it's a common. I'm assuming it's a common. Come on, come on. Let's go. Thank you, Elias. Appreciate you, bro. We got it. I was surprised because we're a little slow getting to it. I guess nobody else is even paying attention. But I got the snipe. Thank you for posting that. Let's go. My only snipe of the day for sure. <laughs> All right. Let's get back in here and see how the Lambos are doing. <clears throat> Check all the floors. Hand me try. Let's go. What's up, Woody? Thank you for hanging out with me. Appreciate you, bro. <laughs> Thank you, Marvelous. At least Hammy was going for it. Kurzimi was going for it. Let's go. I beat a couple of the snipers. Tagged on. I lagged on Star Wars. Yeah, I had a lot of lag too. I was surprised. Yeah, well, finally we did something fun. <laughs> Thank you, Hammy. 31% allocated on today's drop, so they're not sold out. All right, Secret Rare Ventador is at 245, so it's been holding pretty steady at 250. Are you getting down or are you staying? Make up your mind, kitty cat. I guess he's staying. Close my VV app listening to all the FUD. I'm sorry, Kryptoni. You know what we do around here. You got to expect it. I mean, you got plenty of moon boys to listen to. It's all right to have one fudder once in a while. 65. So the Aventador is not doing, doing, doing too bad. It's only like five gems below retail. I guess because not too many of them sold. Where are the rest of them at? I can't even find the rest of them. That's the same ultra rare we just looked at. Literally on there twice. There's the rare. Rare is at... No market is in no way to sell old collectibles. I mean, you got to go way below. Like BE says, you got to go like 20% below the floor price to sell. Right now, the rare is holding up pretty strong at 37, higher than I expected, just because not so many of them have sold. And the uncommon is at 29. Secret rare, 235. Wouldn't mind sitting there trying to snipe those until uh, like a sub 50 popped up for floor price, but that's never going to happen. All right, we'll hang out for a little bit. What's up, Eric? Getting some flash. Whoops. They kidnapped the biggest Moon Boy channel. I'm lost. That's true. They did. He's gone. I don't know. Is he more of a Moon Boy than Randy Chavez? That's a tough one. I mean, they're both just full of crap. However, which one's the bigger Moon Boy? I don't know. All right, all right. Keep my eye out. I still haven't seen anything sub 40. According to KCB, the first four that sold today were all secret rares, which is really interesting. I don't think he would do that, but I don't know. I don't know how that works. Because it's not like Corey's channel, Old Rhubarb, who had VVN3. He became, 
um, the content creator, the official content creator for VB, so he had to get rid of his YouTube channel. But I think that's different than being the community manager. Like, Foster Hill hasn't had to get rid of his YouTube channel. He actually posted a video not too long ago on it after being uh, hired as a community manager. So I don't think MC would have to get rid of his YouTube channel. And I'd be surprised that if he stopped doing as many videos as usual, because why? Why not? What's he going to do? You don't spend a lot of time as a community manager. He's not changing anything he was doing already. He was already hanging out in the VB Discord all the time, I'm sure. Am I crafting the DC Batman comic? What's that? What's that mean? I crafted a, um, uh, what are they called now? Legacy cow? I had two Legacy cows, so I crafted one of them for the safe version. Is that what it's called? Safe something. Safe mode version. And their prices are pretty good on them. Tizo says, be careful buying NFTs from people in the community. That's true. You can buy like some Kid Arcade NFTs just because you like his artwork. And Superstar Money actually puts some real utility into theirs. I'm kind of mad that I don't have any Superstar Money NFTs because they're doing a giveaway for a trip to Disney World in Florida. Is MC going to do a, VV, a video when VV messes up? Yes, to give you an excuse and to tell you why it's a good thing they messed up. Jeff in the house. What's up, Jeff? Says, hire all the VV content creators and take away the only marketing that's happening. I don't know. I guess. They didn't hire me, that's for sure. And I got more views than all the rest of them combined. But oh well. Let's do another one. Number 77, Jason Fabok, Batman. One common for one dollar. Nuh-uh. I will give you two minutes this time. Like, for real? That's like a... I don't know how much. I want to say a 30 or $40 NFT. All right. Y'all ready? This is the Jason Fabok Batman. I think this dropped before I even found BB. Only 25 in the market. I'm surprised they're as cheap as they are. I used to have a couple of these. That's a good looking Batman. Yeah, this is a season one. I guess because there's 5,500 editions, the prices drop like everything on BB. But you could get yourself a nice little payday on this one. He's about to drop it for one Jimmy. First one to get it gets it for one Jim. Hopefully all the good snipers have left. What drop is coming up? I see Stormtrooper at 15 gems. New Star Wars drop? Uh, I know there's three comics dropping this week. One on Tuesday, one on Wednesday, and one on Thursday. Superstar, I like them. At least they keep their morals. That's true. Randy has too much of an ego. I call him out on his terrible omen predictions. Crypto Rain Doctor of stuff admitted to not being experts. Randy refuses to do so. Yeah, Randy thinks he's an expert. Although I've never seen him be correct about anything in three years. Literally nothing. Not one thing ever. Tell me something he's been correct. Please, prove me wrong. It's not like I watch his video, so how would I know? All right, get ready to snipe, y'all. Get ready to snipe. Who is posting this? Man, who is Elias? I don't know if I've seen him in my chat very often. Just out of nowhere. Is this David Hughes' burner account? Oh, I was quick on it. Come on! Oh, I was quick on it, too, but the lag got me. The lag got me. I was so quick getting there, too. Thank you to Elias for posting that for us to snipe. Appreciate you, bro. If it wasn't for the lag, I would have had that. Because I grabbed it as soon as it popped up. Had the perfect scroll down. There it is. Elias RR. Let's check him out. He don't even have a bunch of stuff. And he's just giving it away. Appreciate you, bro. You're a starter. Interesting. Shout out to Elias for giving us something to snipe on. Let's see who got it. On the back cow safe mode, I got mint 451. I got like 1700 something. I got one of the worst mints possible. SM is cool as long as they are, aren't being paid. They hold everyone who doesn't pay them accountable. SM. I don't know what you mean by SM. I should know probably. Yeah, Archer Vader, Vader is below 300. Hit that like button, everybody. BE did not get it. Hammy did not get it. I don't know who got it. I saw Lewis Morgan was flooring everything too. I saw that. They got Foster got in and scanned people in Discord. No, you're thinking of Andre Jeek. But Lewis Morgan is a huge influencer. Been an OG subscriber. Let's go. I don't know who got. Let us know who got the snipe. It wasn't me. It's somebody lurking in the chat who got that snipe. Nobody listening. Listing these Lambos. No activity in the market. Elias is definitely a BB worker that created a quick account and gave him some stuff away to stop the fud. No, I saw his account was uh, created in November of 2021. So he's an OG. Oh yeah, Superstar Money is SM. Duh. My bad. If you would have did SSM, I probably would have figured it out. Randy, is, I told him to sell only before the war, and he goes, what war? I told him the war was coming. I mean, he's a he's a Trump voter, so you can't expect him to be smart at all. He's a Republican. You can't expect him to be smart. 
Did MC replace Racist Ryan Rowe? No, I think um, Foster replaced Racist Ryan. I think MC is doing something different, but I don't know. I could be wrong. Secret Rare has been holding it all right. It's kind of strong. 240, higher than expected. Ultra Rare, 64, still staying somewhat strong. Let's see if any of those sub 40s got listed. I do think uh, I do think Kid Arcade and Biggest Bro are going to be live over on the Kid Arcade channel about 15 minutes after noon, so like 12:15. I want to see the lowest serial numbers. My bad. So if you guys are not checking them out, the link to his channel is in the description. So the lowest on the market is 58. We haven't seen any of the sub 50s yet. That's what I'd like to snipe a sub 50 for floor price. Very low new users. Yes, it's all gym recycling. That's why. They started this new uh, this new comic website for all the gym recyclers so that you have to buy with Fiat. You can't buy with gyms. That was their only way of getting new money into the app. They do what they got to do to make their money. That's why, I don't know, that's why I'm not expecting a lot in the future from the VB community, uh, from the VB team. Always been a great community. Thank you, my man. Spent hours on your live streams back in the day. Happy to give a little back. Let's go. That's my man. Elias, appreciate you, bro. I'll be live for next weekend's drop for sure. I don't know what's dropping next weekend. Hopefully something good. I don't think they've announced it yet. I got blocked by a lot of moon boys when I called out racist Ryan. Did you? I mean, it was pretty obvious if you just do a little bit of research on his account. He was saying some crazy stuff. Now, it was like years ago when he was saying it. So we should, should we still hold him accountable for stuff he said years ago? I don't know. I'm sure I said some crazy stuff at some point in my life. I remember I used to say... We should take all the guns away from everybody. I don't believe it now. And it's kind of crazy to, to think of doing that now. But for a while there, I was like, just take all the guns away from everybody. Forget it. Just get rid of guns. All right. I don't see nothing new hitting the market. About be Might be about time to end the old live stream. I'm going to be trying to do some live streams this week. As long as the market continues to make a little bit of a comeback. Uh, sometimes it'll be on... I used to do it like t Wednesdays and Mondays. But we do have a drop this Wednesday. I try not to uh, do my meme streams, my meme coin live streams on the days that we have drops. Because I know BE's always live streaming over on his channel. But at some point this week, maybe even in the evenings, I'll be doing some streams where I'm sniping some Solana meme coins using my strategy. Which usually does pretty well for me. Billy Bob says, my collectibles has a totally different voice when he goes on another, other streams. The creepy child's voice he uses really makes me uncomfortable. I mean, it seems a little fake to me. I've always said that. Not always, but ever since he started trashing me for selling my Darth Vader for 1200 I used to hate um, McFarlane Digital. Now I'm kind of digging it. I, yeah, I did finally buy my first McFarlane Digital. And then one of the homies a couple weeks ago uh, in the live stream chat, I guess I gave him some alpha on serial number 51 of the cruise from the Tow Mater drop, the Cars drop. He had the actual race car number of that particular car, which he didn't know, and I mentioned it to him. So he was able to sell it for 300 So in return, he sent me a Batman from McFarlane Digitals to add to my collection. I've got the Todd McFarlane, and now I've got a Batman, too. So I've got two collectibles over there. Big Lebowski Digital. Ooh, I want a Big Lebowski. I like that movie. Randy being a Trump voter has more to do with where he lives. Randy lives in Trump country. His part of New York in South Shore, Long Island. That's where the working class lives. Working class is Trump supporters, is that what you're saying? I say in, unintelligent people are Trump supporters. You realize probably 50% of your viewers are probably Republican. I, I know, because crypto is so Republican. I'm just keeping it real, though. I, if you're a Republican, I don't think you're very smart. I, I mean, I can't prove it, but in my opinion, you're not very smart. Thank you, Thanny. Thanks for hanging out. Bring back the alien streams. Oh, I got some new info on alien stuff, too. I'm trying to get Doc Strange to do Strange Vault again. So both dark secret rares <clears throat> for 3.2k. You mean ultra rares, I guess. Yeah, I wish I would have sold more back when my was worth my account was worth like 60k. But you, you live and you learn. This time, if it pumps again, I won't own anything. So I guess I can't do nothing about it. But the next time, I'm way up. <laughs> Calling your own viewers dumb is crazy. I don't give a crap. Yeah, if you're a Republican, you're not smart. Sorry. Both parties are a joke, and there's a lot of people who have that view too. Darth ran away from me on drop. I suffered through the pump. Waited until it dropped to 400 and bought. Then you did all right then, right? Let's leave politics out of things. <laughs> Spread love only. Nah. I keeps it real. Get rid of the two-party system. Ah, a thousand percent agree with that. 
I wouldn't say Republicans are dumb in general. Trump supporters, yes, dumb. I mean, if you can't realize that dude's a con man, you got some problems. McFarlane have got some good utility. The next spawn digital is 60% off for go tier holders. Yeah, but you got to have a bunch to be go tier. Chill, kitty. I'll play with you in a second. I'm almost done. If you need a policy maker to make your life better, you're not smart in my opinion. You spelled you're wrong. So both sides of the same building. <sighs> yes, kind of both sides because they're all establishment and nobody ever talks about getting money out of politics because they want to keep us fighting about stupid stuff so that we don't talk about the important stuff, which is stuff like money and politics. Yes, I've said it before. But I think Trump would like to completely destroy democracy. Like it, somebody who loses and then won't admit they lost, that is just wild to me. Somebody who claims that the other side wants abortion all the way up to and after birth. They want to murder babies. Like that's not true. No Democrat has ever said that. Maybe some crazy people, but come on. They I mean he just straight lies to your face. Politics are dumb. But I'll take it personally because people can have their view. I'm here for the vibes and the flips. Yeah, but I'm always going to keep it real. All right, we stayed around long enough to have Elias post another one for us. An ultra rare, less than two minutes. Let's go. Thanks for hanging out with us, y'all. Thanks to Elias for posting some stuff for us to snipe. I think all these snipers have already left now. It's just me and Hammy going for this one. Fury and his howling commandos. All right, let's see if I can find this. I think that's the first, of a, first appearance of a... I want to say Cage, Nicholas Cage, Nick Cage. All right, I'm trying to find it. And we're doing the ultra rare. There it is, Sergeant Fury and his Howling Commandos ultra rare. This is one of those uh, exclusive covers. And he's posting the ultra rare for one gem any minute now. I'm ready. Let's do this. Shout out to Elias. Thank you for posting that for us. Yeah, when he won, no one cried. Exactly. That's right. I can move in any environment. Americans are so extreme in politics. Aren't isn't every country extreme in politics? I feel like they all are. I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. All right. Good luck, y'all. We're going for another one gem NFT getting posted by Elias for us to snipe. I was able to pick off the Star Wars one already today. Somebody else got the Jason Fabok Batman. I don't know who got that one. That was a good one. I got to it quickly, but I had too much lag. Let me click in here every once in a while to get rid of the lag. See all that lag? It's going to make it tough for me to, to snipe. All right, I'm trying to snipe this one while you guys try to snipe that Pokemon in the in the chat. All right, popping up any second now. And the lag hit hard right there. Ugh, I've got no chance. This is a Sergeant Fury ultra rare this time, y'all. Ultra rare. Floor is at 15, or about 15 gems. And one's going to be listed any second now for one gem. I got a lot of lag right now, so I probably won't be able to snipe it, but I'm going to try. If it pops up fast for me like the Fabok did, and I don't get lagged out when I click buy now, then I should be all right. I don't think there's too many people left watching, so there's probably not a lot of snipers in here. I might have missed it already. Let me know if I did, because I've been getting a lot of lag on the refreshes. Cats are in there meowing. My kid's feeding them right now. That's why. Any second now. Keep my eyes on the prize. Keep my eyes on the prize. It could pop up any second. Did I already miss it? I missed it. Okay. <laughs> my bad. My bad. I'll be sitting here for 20 minutes trying to <laughs> refresh and not looking at the chat. Thank you. Thank you. Who got it? Let me know if you got it. Dan K did not get it. Seems someone scooped it. Enjoy the stream. Thank you, Elias. We'll be back next weekend over here on the OG Vault YouTube channel. Even if we aren't Moon Boys, we still stream the drops and have fun doing it. <laughs> Me too, Hammy. My bad, my bad. I don't know who got that one. Somebody's, somebody's lurking in the chat getting all the snipes. All right, guys. Thanks for hanging out. Be sure to check out Kid Arcade and the biggest bro over on the Kid Ar Arcade channel. All right, let's get some more politics. Uh, my man Crypto Pro is supposed to be doing a politics debate with me. Your democratic process requires vast amounts of campaign spending. I know, and whoever spends the most wins 95% of the time. Yeah, it's not very democratic. I agree. All right, guys, have a great day, and I'll see you all next week. Later.